Hello and welcome to the Invent Geek Arduino Controlled Algae Strobe Project Overview. Um, today we're going to be taking a, just a quick look at our, uh, our Arduino based um, strobe system. Uh, we're using an Arduino platform because for our algae reactors it allows for a lot of future growth. Um, this is just a quick breadboard of the control systems. Um, it's pretty straightforward. We've got uh, three buttons. We've got a pause, faster and slower. We've got our resistors for our buttons. We have a quick terminal block and our LED mounted to it. And we have a TIP120 Darlington transistor. We're using a Adafruit uh, Arduino protoboard. Um, I really like these protoshield protoboards. Um, they allow for really modular, quick experimentation. Uh, you don't have to buy a whole ton of Arduinos. When you can buy the board, they're cheaper and uh, it tends to be a little bit nicer. Now, the thing I like about this board specifically is we have some common buses here for positive and negative. We'll get to that in a second here. So, pretty straightforward. Um, our board simply plugs into an Arduino. This is the world famous Arduino right here. And we simply just snap the two together, uh, line the pins up, and pretty easy. So we've already taken and flashed our Arduino with our application. The application uh, and the diagram for the uh, board can be found at inventgeek.com. Uh, look for our Arduino strobe project. Um, now, a little user friendliness here. We've got ourselves an LCD panel. Um, these are pretty affordable. We picked this up at SparkFun. I uh, really like SparkFun. They've got a lot of really good stuff. Um, decent prices. So we're going to take just a moment here and we're going to plug that into our, our... This is a serial LCD. We have our backpack. So we're running off the serial on the board. And we have our positive bus up top. We have our lower grounded negative bus. There we go. Pretty straightforward. I'll tilt the LCD so the camera can see. And we'll plug it in. Now, the reason that we're using um, the Darlington transistor is this allows us to push a lot bigger load. In fact, right now we're running off the 5 volt um, out on our Arduino. Um, that allows us to flash the LED, pulse it really, really brightly um, without burning it out. We can also run really big arrays of LEDs, and that's something that's really important if you're building a large reactor. So right now, uh, see if I can zoom in here just a hint. We're running at three milliseconds for our delay, and uh, we can take and uh, we can increase this. Let's see if I can make the camera go nuts. Um, and right now, there is no cap set for our pulse rate, and in, uh, in our uh, version 0, 0, 0. 0.1 beta of, of our application that we've loaded up. But it allows for really finite control um, of the millisecond rate for the strobing of this. Now, this is a great way to trick algae into reproducing uh, more than once a day. Um, it also can be used for other techniques, but unfortunately I'm not able to talk about a lot of those uh, because of non-disclosure. However, I do want to make this platform available. Um, you know, we continue doing experiments with algae research and, uh, you know, there's a lot of promise in that. So, basic platform, uh, we hope you get it, tinker with it, experiment with it, try it with the different algae uh, cultures. Um, we're going to expand out the feature set of this simple little setup here. So, it'll, in the future, we'll have uh, a version that'll um, be able to monitor um, temperature of your water, um, density of your culture, um, perhaps even things like salinity. Um, we'll automate things like harvesting, uh, maintenance, topping off water, things of that nature, pumps, um, CO2, recirculators. All that can easily be done with the Arduino. Um, very minimal effort, believe it or not. So, uh, you know, keep an eye on us. Keep an eye on this project. Uh, we're going to evolve it here and uh, hopefully by next spring we'll have a fully developed platform. But uh, you know, before that's my goal. Anyways, Invent Geek Adreno Strobe for algae cultivation and experimentation. There you have it. Um, you can go to inventgeek.com. Um, we have lots of other projects there. And uh, 
algaegeek.com has uh, several bioreactor designs, so if you're an algae buff, great place to go and check it out. Hope you enjoyed this. Thank you.